You ever heard a story you wouldn't believe unless you was there when they told it? And even when they told it, you were kind of like, mm, I don't know. We all down there at the burger shed today over lunch and, and just, you know, we we're talking about Bickham's. They've been doing pretty good on that buffet here lately. And Mort Dwydell took notice. He goes, yeah, those are good ones. He goes, I ain't had a filet like that in many years. He goes, it's very good. It's tender. It's flaky. The batter is terrific. He said, it's the best I've had other than the Siamese catfish. I said, what? Russell Tucker's there too. And he's kind of like, what? Dips the curly fry in the ketchup, just eats away, takes a bite of his chili dog. And we're all kind of quiet there, kind of waiting for... And I said, Mort, did you say Siamese catfish? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, I'm Siamese catfish. And I said, you mean like a catfish that's got two heads on it? Kind of like a thing like that. He goes, yep, that's the kind. And I said, that, that ain't a kind. That ain't, that ain't no Siamese catfish. He goes, there's Siamese everything, Tavin. Years ago, I was down up here in the river, and we were noodling. You know, that's when you go elbow deep and let a catfish just bite on your arm. He goes, I was down there like that away. And I couldn't believe it. I thought I got two catfish. He goes, and I, boy, I was down there for five, six minutes. And he said, I tell you, 35 minutes later, left, right, left, right. And they looking at me, two eyes on this one, two eyes on that one. I looked down, and it's just one body right in the middle. He goes, it was the one and only Siamese catfish. And Russell Tucker said, did you have a camera? He goes, no, that's before you had a camera carried around with you. I didn't take no picture of that. I, you can't take pictures of Siamese catfish. They won't let you. The thing about a storyteller is, is that they'll make up the rules as they go along. Oh, yes, there's Siamese catfish. Oh, yes, it's the best kind of catfish you're going to eat when you fry. Oh, yes, you can't take a picture of them because they won't let you. And I said, Mort, did you ask the catfish? Oh, may I take a picture of you? How do you know they don't let you? He goes, no, they're fierce. They start flopping around. They want to get out of there. One goes this way, one goes that way. But then they meet in the middle because they stuck together. They got the same body like that way, you see. But I got them back home and I cleaned them. I tell you, I've never tasted a finer piece of cuisine than the Siamese catfish. I was looking at Russell Tucker. I was looking at Mort. I looked back at Russell Tucker, thinking in my head, Mort got all the way through that story. He never stopped. He never said, just kidding. He's looking at me as serious as anything. I'm looking at him more serious than that. I said, Mort, there ain't no Siamese catfish. He said, oh, no, not anymore, Tavin. I ate the last one. It was delicious. So I guess the best I'm going to do is have them delicious catfish fillets down there at Bickham's All-You-Can-Eat Catfish Buffet because I ain't ever going to get to taste a Siamese one, apparently. Hey, you ever come across a Siamese catfish? I figure you probably haven't if Mort caught the only one. Go ahead and leave a comment, and we'll talk to you soon. I'll see you later. <laughs>